Hey guys, this is Manak, and I welcome all of you to the part two of the video on column positioning. So, friends, in the previous video, we had seen that this building has two floors, that is the ground floor and the first floor. So, this ground floor has an area of about 1600 square feet, and this has around 640 square feet. So, there is no hard and fast rule for placing columns. As you know, the size of the columns will depend upon the loads which it carries. So the first thumb rule which can be handy while placing columns is that the number of columns in a normal building will be minimum of one column per 100 square feet. So if this building has an area of 1600 square feet so there will be minimum 16 numbers of column here. This is a thumb rule. So the next rule is that so it is not a rule rather we need to take care of it is that it is better if we place the columns along a same line suppose if we place the columns along the same line that is along say I'm taking a line just for showing suppose i place columns three columns along this line suppose one two and three these are in the same line which is better then if I place columns in a staggered position that is if I place one column here another here so placing columns along a same line or along the same alignment is better and another thing we need to take care of is the maximum spacing between two columns should be in the range of 12 feet to 18 feet so the maximum range or the maximum spacing between two columns should not exceed 18 feet it can exceed 18 feet but the size of the column will increase drastically so using these three basic rules or basic thumb rules we will try to place our columns so in the next video we will start placing our columns see you in the next video bye bye